I got something new to whoop on you today. I was experimenting. That's sitting around thinking, smoking a cigar, and said, wait a minute, you know, of all the things that I've done with getting transformed, I have not connected it to a drop down list. But I had to think about what would be a use for such a thing. Here it is. Let's do it. Here we've got this membership data locations, members, levels, dues. All right. We would like a drop down list for the locations that would bring us the number of members at each level. Here's how we're going to do it. We've got to make our queries data from table slash range. Here I'm going to make the contents for the drop down list. This is already highlighted. Right click, remove other columns, filter out the nulls. Okay. Let's close and load that. Let's call this our locations query. I'm going to rename it here. All right. Let's go back to the raw data. And we're going to clean this up. Data. All right. Let's fill down here. These nulls are regular members, so let's call the nulls regular in the level column. Highlight that. Replace values. Null. Regular. Okay. That's all we need. Close and load that by where we put our locations. Close and load two. Put it over here. All right. There's our list. Get rid of these grid lines. View grid lines. Oh, yeah. So now let's name this LOC. Let's go over here, make the drop down list equals LOC. Okay. Now we have our locations. Let's highlight this home just so we can remember where it is. Now we want our members. Now let's put some data in here. Wood Creek. And get rid of these grid lines. Now here's what we have to do. Equals count ifs. What's our criteria range? Go over to queries. Here is our criteria range. Comma. What's the criteria? Let's go back to result. Here. And then put F4 for our absolute cell reference and our next criteria comma we want to grab the lifetime regular new next criteria there comma go back to result we want this beautiful now let's put this whole thing into a table look at that all right. Boom. Wood Creek says there's no new members. Let's go and see. No new members in Wood Creek. All right. Let's look at something else. Edgerton. Three regular members. Yep. Three regular members. Now here is the sexy part. We've got more data. Two new locations. Bring that into the table. Refresh our query. Right. Let's go to the result. Ah, check that out. Our two new locations are in the drop down list. We can retrieve the data. We didn't have to do a damn thing more. Here we go. Let's check out Mirin.
no lifetime members oh but actually Bonita is a lifetime member let's go over here let's refresh oh check that out that's it and that's what we wanted we connected the drop down list and a live query and we've got some live data that can help us control inputs and continue to ensure the integrity of our data think about how you can use this all right what's that tool that cleans your data today tomorrow later and later add new features every month growing greater greater and greater if you said getting transformed you're damn right